Make a guess. How many lakes are there in the United States? Well, according to the National Lake Assessments, there are 112,000 lakes in the U.S. 112,000 and National Lakes Assessment rank this lake the ninth cleanest. Honest to gosh, the ninth cleanest lake in all America. This is New Hampshire's Newfound Lake. Lifestyle.com calls Newfound Lake the eighth cleanest lake in the United States. Smarttravel.com says it is the second most swimmable lake in the entire country. 4,500 acres of open water, 22 miles of shoreline, 183 feet at its deepest point, six miles long, two and a half miles wide. 98 billion gallons of water. Newfound Lake is fed by the Cockermouth River and the Fowler River, and there are eight nat natural springs in the lake bottom. Wellington State Park, which is where we are, has the largest freshwater beach in the state. There it is. Hampton Beach is bigger, but it's not freshwater. Native Americans call this Pasquini, the Algonquin word, meaning the place where birch bark for canoes is found. Back in 1766, a surveying team was sent out by the Masonian proprietors. It was the team that first called this Newfound Pond because they found it. Before that, it was called Baker's Pond. Jeremy Belknap, in his 1791 history of New Hampshire, called it New Chester Pond. And New Chester is what all the land around the lake was called before 1788, when Bridgewater and Bristol and Hill were formed out of New Chester. It was around the time of the Civil War that the railroads first brought people up from the cities in the summer. And just like Lake Sunapee and Lake Winnipesaukee, Newfound Lake also had a number of commercial steamboats that plied its waters. Nowadays, the average property value you're ready for this for a lakeside home is well over a million dollars. A lot of cottages double that. But you know, you don't need a million dollars to enjoy Wellington State Park. And the view from the beach here is as good as any place on the lake.